can or controller area network equipped Ford vehicles come with some high powered software. You may already be aware of some new changes with generic software, new mode 6, and the increased data available with CAN equipped vehicles. I'd like to share with you a tip on using enhanced software. In 2006 model year, Ford added new enhanced ignition diagnostic software. While it may not be for everyone, let's give it a look. Now, before we can use these, let's review secondary ignition waveforms. Wow, there sure is a lot going on here. Let's look at the major components of a secondary ignition waveform. In the old days, with analog scopes, we were not able to store waveforms. With today's digital storage oscilloscopes, waveform analysis is a lot easier. This is where the ignition module grounded the coil. It's the dwell time, measured in milliseconds. This is the energy used to jump the air gap on the spark plug. We measure this in kilovolts. This can change due to engine compression, rich lean condition, and the health of the secondary ignition components like distributor cap, rotors, spark plug wires, and spark plugs. The burn line. Now this is where the good stuff is. Note the KV point. This is the energy used to maintain the spark across the spark plug's air gap. Notice it's much lower than the initial KV. Its amplitude can be measured as approximately 2,000 volts. Burn time, or spark duration. Notice the relatively horizontal line. This is a trademark of a good air fuel ratio and cylinder integrity. Notice the time from point A to B. We can measure this in milliseconds. Now, back to our live action waveform. Notice how everything's in motion. This is because the combustion chamber is a harsh environment. But that's okay, we get the overall picture. Now back to our scan tool. With enhanced software, a Ford PCM can measure spark duration electronically. Check your scan tool. See if you can graph spark duration. 2006 and newer Fords with the new larger coil-on-plug coils have a more sophisticated ignition diagnostic monitor built into their PCMs. On these engines, the scan tool will display spark duration to aid in diagnosis. If a cylinder has a spark duration that is shorter than the others, it indicates a short to ground in the secondary. This can occur due to a fouled plug or carbon tracked coil. The spark duration should vary with the engine running. If one cylinder has a steady spark, it may indicate the spark is traveling through air, perhaps through a hole burned through the coil on plug boot. In other words, if the spark did not have to deal with the combustion chamber environment, the burn time would be more consistent. We can still use our favorites like mode 6, primary voltage analysis, or even power balancing testing with our scan tool. Like I said earlier, this may not be for everyone, but it's another tool we can use in Ford Misfire Diagnostics. Thank you for watching Technician's Toolbox. I'm Wayne Bishop. So long for now.